Today I want to teach you EpiPen how to use it and how you can teach if you need to in your exam. EpiPen is a single use drug delivery device. It contains adrenaline in it and it is to prevent the anaphylaxis. This is very important for someone who is known to have anaphylaxis. They should keep it all the time with them. Uh, now, there are three three parts of this. Uh, this blue is the locking key and uh, if it is in place, it will not work at all. And this is a safety cover for the needle and the needle is hidden inside. The middle part contains the medication, which is adrenaline. Now, um, before we deliver, we need to make sure that the patient knows what they need to look for, what are the signs and symptoms like uh, uh, difficulty in breathing, swelling, itching, rashes, nausea, vomiting. These are the important signs and symptoms. We need to make sure that we explain this to the patient and they know what they need to look for. Now, uh, before we inject, we need to look on a few things make sure that you check the expiry expiry is given on here in this red strip okay and in the real pen where you have the actual pen this is actually a trainer pen in the real pen you will see this white window and this window is normally clear there should not be any color at all and explain this to the patient that before you use you need to make sure that you check the expiry in this red strip and you look at the color you should not be able to see any color normally it is clear if you see any color it means it is not good to use now before you use it make sure that the patient is in appropriate position in talking about uh, uh, flap 2 examination uh, if this is a child make sure the child is uh, comfortable you do not need any privacy but you need to make sure that the, uh, it is safe for you as well as for the child before you give take this blue top out okay because if it is there it will not work so remove this then hold it firmly making sure that you can read the English clearly if you are not able to read like in this case it means that you are holding it inappropriately. So hold it firmly in your fist and you do not need to press anything. Bring it to the side of the thigh and press it against the thigh until you hear the click. After you hear the click, keep it there at least three seconds and then you can remove it. There are a few precautions that you need to make sure that there is no metal otherwise the needle will bend and the medication will not go in at the same time it is important that the parents call the ambulance and tell them anaphylaxis so that the ambulance comes as soon as possible ideally the patient should have two epipens they should wait maximum for up to five minutes if they do not feel any benefit give one more dose okay and in the meantime Hopefully the ambulance will arrive. You can see after you've injected this orange part has come out. It is the safeguarding for the needle. You will not see the needle at all at any point. Now there are few things that you need to know. You should not keep EpiPen if it has entered last six months of their expiry. Go and get, in, get a new supply from the GP or from the pharmacist and also you can suggest the parents to put the alarm to maintain a diary and check the expiry regularly before it expires change it so that you have good supply in your hand apart from that you can keep this in at room temperature avoid from the extremes of temperature like do not put in the fridge and do not put in the sun that's all about it and after you have called the ambulance and the ambulance has arrived the child will go to the hospital will need further observation and monitoring thank you